Welcome back, everybody. We're going to be showing you now how to do... There it is. Ashton Fine. Mask Anyways, we're going to be showing you guys how to do the jewelry heist now. Silently. Nothing's a seizure, so... I guess I'll just wait for him to turn around. Watch the guard. It's a guard. Watch the guard. Guard over there. It's a guard. Guard. Guard over there. It's a guard. Guard over there. It's a guard. Hey. Don't talk to me about the goddamn That king nearly got me fired. All right, let's roll. Okay, this over mission, there? you do want to make sure that... Yeah, everything's fine here. Great, actually. Phones. What did you think? That some clowns were trying to rob the place or something? <laughs> I'm gonna pick him up and move him. You also okay, his right. Uh, time. I think that sounds good. Guards and window. cameras everywhere. Don't Be careful. my purse! <laughs> the really good stuff is in the VIP area display case. Everything's all right here, buddy. Just peachy, if you ask me. Right, right. Sounds great. him in here. We're going to move her just in case this guard outside comes in. The manager's office is the best place to put them because they do not enter into the manager's office. You're going to interact with the manager's computer. And then I cracked the password. For the basement code subject. And it'll tell you where it's at. So it is on the top of the storage cabinet in the VIP room. So the VIP room is right here. Again, you're going to use that QR code from that phone to open the door. There is going to be a camera right here. Watch it around those display cases. If you touch them, it'll set off the alarm. See if you can disable it from the basement. Then you're gonna come. I can never remember where the storage cabinet is in here. There we go. 4353. Three. That's going to be the basement code. Yeah, right hey there, there, buddy. Just saw something that kind of spooked me, but uh, turns out it was nothing. You go back to sleep now. Yeah, I can see that. That's good to hear. Alright, so then you're going to come over here. You're going to lockpick this door. Then you're going to flip this circuit breaker. Well done. That takes care of the display case alarm. Now... I would highly advise you to crack this safe. Because in this safe, it's going to have information of how to get basically blackmail the manager in order to open up the room that you need to get into to clean the jewelry. 
You don't have to clean the jewelry, but if you do clean the jewelry, your take-home will be a lot more. Hold on. I'd like to take a close look at those documents. Send me a picture. Holy shit. Illegal trade routes? Blood diamonds? This is proof of all their dirty little secrets. This should get the manager's attention. Patch me through to her cell from the phone in her office. Alright, so then we're gonna come over here. We're gonna use the phone. That way we can get her back here. It's ringing. I used to take this uh, hi hostage. there, how you doing? Uh, listen, I I'd take Down. a look at the security now. systems in the basement if I were you. Wouldn't you just hate it if those documents were seen by the wrong people? So this manager is now going to come back here. <laughs> just like the previous mission with the manager, you're going to throw her at this. Ah! As soon as the door unlocks, there is a camera here. Oh god! And again, if you have the instant unlock ability, you can unlock all these instantly. Alright, so now what you're going to do is you're going to come the over to this machine, the and you're going to throw there. them all inside of the cleaner. You can throw several of them in there at once, so you don't have to do one at a time. these clean jewelry packets are going to have these X's on them. The standard do not have the X's on them. And then you are also able to now open up all the display cases and take all the jewelry. Take that. I'm here. Put the back in the back. if you want or go back and get some more that's four now if you are playing with friends there has to be two of you in this safe 
there is a rare mineral that is worth actually a pretty good amount of money. With that key card that we picked up, the red one down in the basement next to the safe that we cracked, you're going to grab that card. You're going to have one person standing here ready to swipe the card while the other friend is here at the manager's desk and holds down this button. As soon as you hold it down, you'll be able to see that light up red. See? Able to use it now. But that button you have needs to, to be pushed at the same time you swipe the card. Get hold of one of the employees and make them push it. Five bags and counting. Okay, so apparently what she just said is you can get one of the employees to do it. Uh, let me go! I honestly did not know that. Suck the floor. All right, and this gem does not need to be cleaned. That's it six. will not get clean, so. So yeah, that is how you do dirty ice solo.